Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to Championship Addictions. Just before we get started, this video is sponsored by LOL T-Shirt Company. Um, you might have heard of them before, if you have, then you know they do sell my merch. Um, the link for my merch is down in the description below, so go feel free to check it out after watching this video. Um, a few results not exactly going to plan this weekend just gone. Um, there is still one game to be played as I'm filming this. Um, or recording it, whatever way you want to put it. Only reason I'm still doing it, um, with that game still to play is because I don't think it'll change my results. Um, so, you know, this why I'm doing it now. Um, but anyway guys, you know what to do, subscribe for more, thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first game is Barnsley versus West Brom. Um, Barnsley beating Millwall 2-1 away from home. Great three points for Barnsley. Um, you know, Barnsley are currently on 19 points with literally a point um, just outside the relegation zone. This is one of the tightest relegations I've seen in a while. Um, West Brom 1-1 at home to Brentford. Um, a slightly disappointing day for West Brom. Um, you know, overall. Um, but that doesn't really matter because of the league's result, which I will get down to when I get down to the league's fixture. This game is going to be interesting for... A matter of reasons. Will Barnsley, you know, um, finish outside the relegation zone um, before they play on the 28th, I think it is. Um, you know, and is Barnsley going to really push on? I'm going to give them a yes for this one, and I'm going to go for another one all scoreline for West Brom. My next one is Blackburn versus Birmingham. Blackburn's game is still yet to be played, but as I said at the top of this video, it ain't going to change my mind over this result. Um, Birmingham loses 3-0 away to Hull City. Disappointing day for Birmingham. Um, and obviously, because the Blackburn game has not yet been played, um, Blackburn are currently in 10th. Whereas Birmingham are in 15th place with 28 points. Um, I'm going to go for a Blackburn win. And I'm going to go for a 2-1 Blackburn win. My next one is Brentford versus Swansea City. Brentford 1-1 away to West Brom. Great point for Brentford. Swansea City beating Luton Town 1-0 away from home. Great three points for Swansea. Uh, Swansea are currently in sixth with 37 points. Um, Brentford are currently in fifth with 37 points. Only two things that are splitting the teams apart is goal difference. Um, so this is going to you know, be another close game. And I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Cardiff versus Millwall. Um, Cardiff 0-0 at home to Preston. Probably a good point for Cardiff. Um, Millwall losing 2-1 at home against Bansley. Um Millwall are currently in 13th. So not doing too bad. Um, Cardiff are coming in 12th. Bit disappointed considering they only got relegated from the Premier League last season. Um, but which way do I call this one? I'm going to think that Mill's going on a bit of a downer after that defeat to Barnsley. So I'm going to go for a 2 0 Cardiff City win. My next one is Charlton Athletic versus Bristol City. Um, Let's go over to the scores. Um, Bristol City losing 1-0 away from home to Sheffield Wednesday. Um, you know, very much 
off the cuff um Shouting uh two two away to QPR. Um Charlton are currently in eighteenth with twenty five points. Um Bristol City are outside the playoff places with thirty five points, just two points outside the uh, playoff places. Bristol City um Lost two games on the bounce. Um, so I'm going to go for a 2 1 Chelsea and Athletic win. My next one is Hull City versus Nottingham Forest. Hull City beating Birmingham 3 0 at home. Um, Nottingham Forest losing 2 1 away from home to Huddersfield. That's two games in a row Notts Forest have lost. Um, Good three points for Hull. Hull are currently in 11th. Um, Notch for Forest are 9th. 34 points. Um, because Notch Forest have had a bad couple of weeks, I can only call this game one way. And I'll go for a 2 1 Hull City win. My next one is Luton Town versus Fulham. Fulham, 2-1 winners at home to Leagues. Great three points for Fulham. Luton Town losing 1-0 at home to Swansea City. Um, disappointing day. Well, no, I can't even say disappointing day for Luton, really. I mean, they're going up against Swansea, who are in the playoff places. Um, but great day for Fulham. Another disappointing day for Leagues. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Fulham win. My next one is Middlesbrough versus Huddersfield. Um, Middlesbrough beating Stoke 2-1 at home. That was a Friday night game. Huddersfield beating Nottingham Forest 2-1 at home. Um, so great three points for both clubs. I watched that Middlesbrough game, um, and I think overall Stoke to have a point out of that, but fair play to Middlesbrough. Um, great day for Huddersfield, um, as I've already stated that it was a disappointing day for Nottingham Forest, but as far as this result goes, I'll go for a one-all scoreline for that one. My next one is Stoke versus Sheffield Wednesday. Um, Stoke, uh, two one losers away from home to Middlesbrough. Sheffield Wednesday beating Bristol City one nil. Um, Stoke are currently two points off the safety. Um, going up against Sheffield Wednesday, who are currently in seventh, so they really have moved up the table. Um, over the previous couple of weeks. 36 points, just in a point outside the playoff places. Um, I'm going to go for a 3-1 Sheffield Wednesday win. My next one is Wigan Athletic versus Derby County. Um, Wigan still yet to play um, Blackburn. As I've said, I don't think it changed my mind on the result I'm going to give. Derby County losing 3 0 away to Reading. Um, Wigan, you know, are doing okay. Coming on 18 points, same as Stoke. Um, going up against an iffy Derby County team. Um, but as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 1 0 Wigan win. My next one is Leeds United versus Preston North End. Um, Leeds losing 2 1 away to Fulham. Preston North End 0 0 away to Cardiff. As I said, these have had a disappointing uh, couple of weeks. Um, Preston are 
very much in the playoff places, 38 points, and possibly one of the only two teams that can really try and catch Leeds at this present time. And yes, I do know there's a point between all the playoff uh, clubs as it stands. Um, but I'm going to go for a 1 0 Preston win. My last one for this weekend or Boxing Day is Reading versus QPR. Reading uh, beating Derby County 3 0 at home, QPR 2 2 at home of Chelton Athletic. Reading are currently in 16th, QPR in 14th. Um, no, it can't be a table changing game, unfortunately. But being close in the table, I'm going to go for a one all scoreline for that one. But anyway, guys, have a fantastic Christmas. If you're going out, please be safe. Um, stay safe. Um, hope you have a brilliant Christmas. Um, my ones for the um, 28th will, will be coming up. I'm not sure which date yet, so keep an eye out. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.